<sighs> What's up, everybody? Man, it's your boy, Mr. Do Got coming at y'all another video, man. <sighs> and today, I'm going to talk about some good news and some bad news. The good news is that Atlanta Braves beat the Washington Nationals 10-1 to to um actually clinch a playoff berth and also cut the magic number down to four to win the NL East. Um, you know, great performance. It was a one nothing game for the most part. Uh, late in the game, the offense just really got going, yo. Um, Nick Marquez has got what like three or four singles today. Um, Ronald Acuna hit today. Austin Riley hit. Ozzy Albies hit. Down, I mean, just everybody hit the ball today, man. Late in the game, bro. Um, you know, and like I said, the team been playing well. The team been really doing their thing. Um, really good pitcher performance again by Fote, by Fote. Uh, I think we won like pretty much all his starts since we called him back up, or at least most of them. Um, and like I said, clinch the playoff bird, uh, magic number to four to win the NL East. Those are, you know, big blowout win against the team chasing you. Um, those are all the, the, the good points of today. Yo. Really a lot of good things happened today. <sighs> the bad thing, man, um, I think what it was the seventh inning um, when it was a 1-1 one -one game, uh, we had runners at first and second with nobody out. And uh, Charlie Coberson came in to hit for, um, to hit, I think, for Fulton Evich. Man, and just a frightening sight, man. When he went to bunt, the ball hit him directly in the face, man. And he just went down, and you could see blood, and he was down for a while, and eventually it was able to get him up. It's like when they got him up, you could have kind of see, you know, a little bit, because most of his face was covered, but a little part of his face you could have see, You could have seen blood on the towel, and you could have seen that his face was completely swollen, man. Um just just a horrific thing man um prayers for charlie um he's been just a real good staple to this team he's filled in you know especially when um dansby swanson first got hurt yo he played a lot of shortstop for us man um you know him and you know him and camargo which prayers to camargo too man following that ball off of his shin and it looks like you know he he has a i think a fractured shin and he may be out for the rest of the you know the, the uh season or whatever you know those are two guys man that's key players on our bench man um yeah it's just a real frightening thing to see man uh prayers for charlie man the team rallied around him you know way to rally for charlie get the w but prayers for him man real scary it's unbelievable they called that a strike also man <laughs> snip went crazy rightfully so the, the wood got on the ball. The ball directly hit him right in the face, which, you know, the Washington Nationals pitcher didn't mean to do it, man. And, you know, um, you could tell after that, it kind of, you know, they was talking about it on the broadcast, but you could tell it really did kind of shake him up also, yo. Because as a competitor, man, you don't want to see that happen to nobody, man. But, you know, prayers for Charlie, man. You know, prayers for Camargo also from the injury the other day, man. Um. You know, big win for the team, man. We just got to, you know, gather it together and keep on pushing, man. We clinched the playoff spot today, yo. Get better, Charlie and Camargo. But, um, but with that being said, man, that's all I got for y'all tonight. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, hit the like button for your boy and give me a subscribe, man. I'm going to have Atlanta Braves content throughout the year. Also, on Tuesday at 6 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Central. 3 p.m. Pacific, I will do a live Q&A. Come on there, ask me anything. I'll answer your questions and shout you out, yo. Y'all have a blessed one. Chop on.